Good Tuesday morning. I'm meteorologist Ted Schmidt. Stuck in the gloom again this morning, but I think this time around there will be change during the day. Yesterday we didn't get out of the clouds. The, the temperature didn't change at all. We, we, it was steady at 30 degrees the entire day. Uh, in December, that can that happens. I mean, it happens quite a bit actually this time of the year. You get those days where it's just stagnant uh, and no uh, change in air mass and uh, no sunshine. It just stagnant, no wind even. Uh, today, a little more of a breeze out of the south, and that with eventually some erosion of that cloud cover. I think we'll see some of that coming in by uh, early afternoon. That should help things warm up. So we're looking at increasing sunshine later on and the possibility of maybe reaching the 40s, somewhere we have not been since last week. But right now, 28 degrees from Assisi Heights. A lot of gloom in the distance there. Low clouds and a little bit of fog. That's our, our quality group camera from Assisi Heights. And from here, Again, we're looking at an improvement for the second half of the day. And actually, the next couple of days will feature some sunshine. So we have that to look forward to, uh, at least for the midweek. Right now, looking at the situation here, uh, as we move along here for our Tuesday, we'll have the clouds, and then uh, that southwest wind will kick in. And we see that in our day plan, our increasing sunshine later on. High temperature around 41 degrees, which is uh, about a dozen degrees above the seasonal average. So quite a bit warmer than your typical December day. You know, it may not seem warm overall, not certainly compared to the summer or even fall, but 41 in December is uh, is not half bad. Not too windy. Winds 10 to 15 miles per hour. That keep the wind chill mainly in the 30s. 28 right now. Uh, it feels like 17. And here we are just a little bit after 8:30 on this Tuesday morning, and uh, so far kind of a gloomy situation here, but. Uh, again, that's going to change. Wind chill 19 right now. Overcast skies here in Rochester looking northward. Temperatures across the map uh, 28 in Rochester, 28 in Mason City, 32 in Winona, and uh, 28 in Owatonna. That seems to be a popular number. 28. Uh, here's that warm front poised to swing through the area. Once it does in the midday hours, we'll see the sky slowly clear off. At least the stratus clouds, the low gray clouds, and the fog will lift. Winds will pick up a little bit out of the southwest. Still a fair amount of high cloud cover, those whiter uh, looking clouds. Those are uh, cirrus clouds coming in out of the northwest ahead of another storm system that will come in for the tail end of the week. But right now, here's future track looking at the erosion of that cloud cover. There it is, afternoon sunshine, southeast Minnesota, northeast Iowa. Tonight, aside from a passing cloud or two, pretty quiet night. Temperatures around 30. And then tomorrow, more of a westerly and then northwesterly breeze, but still a nice day. We start in the 30s, we make our way to around 48, some spots as warm as the low 50s tomorrow afternoon. That'll be by far the warmest day of the week and the warmest day of the month. I think that will probably hold up as the warmest day of the month. It should be get to the upper 40s. And then going into a Thursday, just a few passing clouds. There is a cold front coming through. A uh, bigger storm system comes in for the tail end of the week and again on Friday and Saturday. Still a lot of question marks with that system. Its track could be uh, all over the place. Uh, the possibilities are, are, are certainly uh, pretty pretty broad in the scope. Uh, a lot of variety of, of possibilities headed our way for the end of the week. But today, 41 in Rochester, 47 in, in Mesa City, 46 in Albert Lee. Clouds, then some sunshine. Fairly mild afternoon, 10 to 15 mile per hour winds out of the southwest. Tonight, a light breeze, partly cloudy, chilly, and 30. And then tomorrow, a fairly light northwest breeze, mostly sunny, very mild, 48 for your Wednesday. That's the day to get really excited about, especially if you're hoping for uh, fall to hold on for a little bit longer before we go into winter. We are going to see elements of winter coming up. See, this is a three-day preview. Uh, by Friday, already a chance of rain and or snow. A storm system clipping us to the south uh, could bring several inches of snowfall or rain and a snow mixture that would really reduce that snow potential. And right now, that may be the, the stronger likelihood, but of course, we'll wait and see. And then 33, some very light snow showers on Saturday, especially early and raw winds too. 33 light dusting of snow possible there. Jet stream, we're looking at the changes here. There's a big mass of cold air coming in for the weekend. And then next week, still some pretty chilly weather ahead. Temperatures by then mainly in the 20s and 30s. And that's definitely more December-like than the upper 30s, the 40s we've had so far pretty much every day this month. Uh, again, Friday and Saturday, the possibility of um, Really, the, the range is, 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 is significant. I mean, one to four or five inches, maybe more. But at this point, I'm thinking that the outliers, the data we're seeing that it could be an outlier. The h really high stuff, I think that is less likely to happen, but a few inches of snow possible Friday if that system stays far enough north. Uh, data that has been coming in more recently keeps it farther south. So we may not see everything that we've been talking about right now. There's still a chance that uh, that all everything's on the table or all of this could go by the wayside. We'll keep an eye on that anyway for Friday. And then some very light snow showers behind that system on Saturday. And some light snow Monday of next week. Maybe a minor coating there. Um, 
at this point less than an inch in that situation. Another one Wednesday of next week would be one that could bring a few inches, not really, really heavy snow, but it could be a few inches on Wednesday. Uh, that would be a week from uh, tomorrow. In the meantime, today, uh, enjoy the afternoon sunshine that's headed our way and get excited about those 40s. Tomorrow looks even better. And you know, of course, if you're excited about winter we still have the, several possibilities there so i think everybody should be equally happy and frustrated <laughs> because we've got the gloom we've got the snow we've got things that a lot of people like a lot of people hate us but anyway it is december and uh you know we do what we have to do and we survive any way we can anyway have a great day we will see you back here tomorrow for hump day